Hi there. I wanted to just briefly go over the World War I propaganda with you because we're going to do this again when we get to World War II. So I gave you, let me look on the website really quick. I gave you like three links, but don't spend a whole lot of time with those. It's just to kind of like show you some images. The, um, the link that says World War I propaganda and women, that one has kind of like a, just a brief explanation about like the purpose of these posters and kind of groups them by themes. You can really just skim that, you know, maybe a few minutes on that page. And then I gave you two other ones, two other links, view select women's recruitment and relief, relief agency posters and then Handler Chandler Christie. Those, uh, the reason I gave you those ones is those links specifically look at women in these uh, propaganda posters. So, you know, again, like you, this is, this could be a rabbit hole. You could spend a lot of time on these sites, but you don't need to. It's just so you can get kind of a, a, an overview. So really don't spend more than 10 minutes looking through those links. Um, I put in the module for you kind of uh, six key posters. And the first two, it's up to you, protect the nation's honor. Remember when we looked at those images of liberty uh, with Republican mother, uh, Republican motherhood? Here's liberty and she's being attacked. And so um, now liberty is something that needs to be protected uh, when it's in the um, shape of a woman. And the G, I wish I were a man, this is a way to shame. Well, actually, so is the first one. They're both ways of shaming men into joining. But gee, I wish I was a man, right? There's this, this, this cute little girl wants to join the um, Navy. So certainly, you know, you want to. And even includes the, ugh, don't say it, but it includes the caption there, be a man and do it. So hopefully something that we don't say today. Um, so again, those, those two images are there to shame men into serving. And then the other images, what you want to look at there, the other four, is how they in some ways reflect some of the same things we'd expect to see for women, right? Women as mothers, women standing behind their man. Um, but in other ways, there's, there's some maybe surprising possibilities for women here. Like if you look at the for every fighter, a woman worker, those women are wearing pants. And actually the women get behind the girl left behind during the land army, she's wearing pants. That is pretty shocking for her to be wearing pants in the um, early 20th century. It was pretty shocking to wear pants, Ooh, really until the late 20th century. <laughs> and professional women, right, were, uh, you know, like in the 80s, it was the power suit. And that was, those weren't pants, those were skirts. I mean, think about all the conversations about Hillary Clinton's pantsuits. Um, you know, why is that relevant? Except that she's wearing pants. And that was in 2016. Um, so pants in, um, you know, uh, the early part of the 20th century is, is a pretty shocking thing. Um, these are emergency circumstances though, so that's okay for her to be wearing pants. And then um, two, for every fighter, a woman worker, that one, like they're lined up, it looks like a, like a, a military procession. They're also holding tools. Um, and so again, sort of speaks to their strength. Um, back, sometimes students point out too, it says back our second line of defense. Now, for the second, but we're still there seen as, you know, necessary and significant in this war. Um, and then again, the girl he left behind, um, get behind the girl left behind again, she's still, it's still her connection to her husband or her brother or her father, but um, she's wearing pants. She's um, seen as essential. So in, in this way, we're gonna be seeing some shifting possibilities. Um, now we'll come back to these images again. We'll look at World War II and we're going to see World War II. Whew, there's going to be, um, definitely more possibilities in World War II. Uh, so, uh, we'll come back to these images again in a few weeks. All right. If you've got any questions, you can leave those in the discussion board with the module. Take care.